Tuesday afternoon, November 5th, uh, we're now at the uh, Long Yang uh, Road uh, Maglev Terminal, and we're going to be taking the Maglev uh, high-speed train to uh, Hudong International Airport. Um, I should point out that this is probably the best way to get to the airport and the cheapest way. Uh, a round trip will cost you somewhere in the neighborhood of $15.00. And uh, one way uh, would cost you something like about, uh, oh, it's really amazing, it's like $7. So this is a great ride. The train covers the 19-mile uh, trip between here and the airport in about eight minutes. Uh, so it's uh, actually operational speed of about 164 miles per hour at its tops. Um, this train, however, has been clocked in tests at 310 miles per hour, so you could probably say, using that metric, that is probably the fastest train in the world, certainly the fastest train in the world without wheels. And that brings me to why they call it maglev. Maglev means magnetic levitation. This train does not have any wheels. It rides on a magnetic field and is pushed by magnets, uh, which makes it an amazing uh, operation.
first ever iPhone camera. <laughs> Coverage of the whole Maglev train ride <coughs> from Shanghai to Pudong International Airport. Uncut. We're here at Pudong International Airport. We did 19 miles in about eight minutes, which is incredible. Uh, I hope you appreciate this video because it's the only video I know of on YouTube, uh, which uh, gives you the complete uh, trip from Shanghai to Pudong International Airport on the Meglev train. Uh, also, it's unusual in the sense that it was shot with an iPhone camera. Um, please note and please uh, I apologize for the quality of the uh, video because the iPhone camera has some issues when the camera is actually in motion but if you noticed on the trip out here when I could keep the camera still it did a great job in terms of uh, filming the countryside. Here's a front shot of this uh, incredible Maglev train. Dear passengers, waiting 